here. I hope you all had a wonderful New Year's Eve and that you didn't get too drunk or that you didn't fight with anyone or that you didn't get blown up by any fireworks. I mean, that happens. Uh, I just so I just watched Chris's New Year resolutions and I think it's awesome, 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 Chris. Very proud of you. Uh, I'm proud of you for doing great in school. I'm proud of you for wanting to continue being great in school, and I'm also so proud that you got a job offer, and I think you should take it uh, if you. If you feel that you have time for it, then you should because you learn so much from real life experiences. I mean, school is awesome. You're awesome in school. I was never awesome in school. The only thing I was awesome at was to turn up, uh, be polite, art, music, and like home, what's it called? Like housewife duties. It's not called housewife duties, but it, there was a class where you learn how to take care of your home, you know, call it housewife duties. So, I don't remember my resolutions for from last year. I don't know why. Maybe I didn't have any. I'm not sure. Or I just don't want to remember. Um, I can say that I'm grateful for having my sister over last summer. And I'm grateful, I'm grateful for being able to bring my boyfriend with me to Thailand to meet my grandma, my aunt, my cousins, uncles, and all of that. Uh, we also got a chance to go diving, which is awesome. Shout out to everyone that went on that diving trip. I'm also very grateful. That's a hard word. I'm thankful for. Um, my new job, I'm thankful for that my boss, bosses, brought me with them to this new uh, company. Thank you. I'm so thankful for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I can't thank, I can't thank you enough. I can't thank you enough. I hope this year will be awesome for us, the little beauty team, and everyone else, all 800 of them. Great, great new year to all of us. So yeah, to my new year resolutions. I have five or six, I don't remember, beauty resolutions that I want to share with you. Number one is hand cream. I'm actually pretty good at using hand cream, but I have been being bad at it. Um, the last few weeks so my hands are dry so I said to myself I am gonna be good at it again I usually have my uh, hand cream in my purse but I don't know it's you know it's been cr it, Christmas was here and that's crazy because you go from one house to another you unpack your bag you bring another bag and then you just don't bring everything so this thing has been gone for a while this is currently my favorite it's not my favorite hand cream because I have been a part of making this um, into a live product that's not why that's of course a big part of it but I love the scent it's lavender and I love the fact that, um, that it's all natural products and I also love the fact that it's made in Sweden that is good for the environment not that it's bad to, to produce stuff in other countries, I just mean that it's produced in Sweden and it's sold in Sweden, which means that there haven't been too many airplanes or boats or cars or trucks or whatever that's been running back and forth in order to bring this to my house. And it's called Sense of Karma and I also love the fact, I think that's the best part of it, is that Sense of Karma donates uh, money to a charity program, a small charity program called Help at Hand, a small program that do great and big wonders in the Philippines. Now, resolution number two, face masks. I'm actually pretty good at using face masks, but I want to 
bring it up again. And also hair masks. I'm n I don't have any to show you because I don't use them. Four, drink more water. I'm very bad at drinking water, so I'm gonna start drinking water. And I think it's good for my, my health, my skin, my hair, my nails, my everything. So water, yes. Fifth one is hit the gym twice a week, no excuses. My excuse for not hitting the gym as I used to might not be the best excuse in the world, but I do have one. And that is that the, uh, the constructor that uh, used to, who was this former, uh, former Greek champion, he was so awesome, like he would make us crawl, sweat. First time I went there, he yelled at me for laughing with my friends and all three of us had to get down on the floor and do push-ups in front of everyone and I didn't know, know how to make a push-up so that was pretty embarrassing I never laughed again at that I mean I did but not when he didn't want me to but he made people bleed sweat some people even fainted so to me that was awesome I need military in order to like you know work out and it's been like a year since he left. He moved to another city, so I've been trying to take it back now. And I mean, it's okay. I can't blame it on him, even though you little suck. No, I'm just kidding. I just wish that there was another person that could make me almost faint. And the sixth one, yes, I have a sixth one. Go to bed early, wake up early, go back to my old routines. I'm not gonna get stuck with staying up late and being all puffy when I wake up in the morning. I don't want to be that anymore. I am very good at going to bed early. I'm very good at waking up early and being fresh and clean. But, and I blame this on you colleagues, my two closest colleagues that I love, they, they, they go to bed. No, I, I don't know when they go to bed. I just know that they love, no. I just know that they don't like to wake up early because they think it's very cozy to be in the bed and stuff and they always talk about that so I have like been, I have turned into these, one of these people that like to stay in bed in the mornings and I, I don't want, I have to turn it back, I have to go to bed early because that's a, 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 a good way to get up early and I need to use you know, my hand cream, my hair mask, my face mask drink my water, hit the gym, and wake up early, go to bed, wake up fresh and nice. That's my beauty resolution for 2016. Solutions. I tried to be fast, I didn't want this to be a boring video. Alright everyone, have a great 2016. Make sure it's the best year of all times, and lovey dovey XO, ciao.